<laughs> What's going on guys? Check out this stash. November is just about over and this is the last phase that this mustache is going to go to. Anyway, if you haven't already, take a look at the link down below and go over to my November page and take a look at how this stash has evolved over the last 30 days. Anyway, that's not the purpose of this video. The purpose of this video today, I am in the hot Arizona sun right now. It is time to shed a layer. Now, the layer that I've been using recently is a heated electric vest. Now, the reason for today's video is actually to tell you about the vest that I'm wearing underneath my Climb Carlsbad jacket. Layering is key when you're riding a motorcycle. This morning I left and it was about 48 degrees and now it's getting close to 80 degrees and it's definitely time to get rid of the layer underneath. Now a key thing that I've been using for years is heated jackets and vests. First Gear is my favorite brand that I've ever worn. I'll go into that a little bit later. But more recently I picked up this economical vest here that I'm wearing now. It's uh, W-I-N-N-A, I believe is the name of the organization or the brand. Pick this thing up off of Amazon for $49.99. Now this is a puffer vest, so even if you don't use the heated function, it still keeps you nice and warm. Now here in the pocket, now this vest does not come with a battery bank. Uh, this is my own personal battery bank. It's actually the brand called Lubron. We've got a link to that down here in the description as well. But this thing is awesome. This can charge my iPhone three times. Now you don't have to worry about carrying cables with you. It has a micro USB, it has a USB-C, and it has an iPhone, Apple uh, charge port, a lightning cable. So this will allow me to charge my phone three times while out there on the trail or wherever I'm at. And my heated vest, take a look at this. I plugged this one in. So for a long time, I've been using my first gear heated vest. Um, I wore that one out. That thing cost $299 when it was new, $300, that's right. This thing here is 50 bucks. I got a button here. I can choose between three different colors or power modes. You've got high range, mid range, and low range. On low range, I can wear this jacket almost all day, about seven and a half hours. On medium range, I get about four hours, and I get about an hour and a half to two hours on high range. Again, something like this is super nice because it already uses a charge bank that hopefully you're carrying with you in case of emergency anyway. Again, this thing here was about, I want to say it was 39 bucks. If I remember right when I bought it, I think they're about 50 bucks now as well. But anyway, this thing is a lifesaver. Charges anything. It charges my cameras. It charges my phone. It plugs into my vest and keeps it nice and charged up. So again, this vest is 50 bucks. I have links to it down in the description below. Now, this vest on the listing, the listing's kind of weird. Large is the largest size that they have, but when they ship it to you, it's going to end up being an extra large. Um, I would actually like a larger vest than this. This one's a little bit snug. I mean, it does an okay job. Now the zippers seem to be a quality material. Again, this is an extra large shipped in the package. I ordered large on the website um, and I would like it to be just a slightly bit larger than it is. There's a large um, heat patch there in the back and there are two heat patches here on the stomach. Now the difference between this and my first gear heated vest is the fact that my first gear does have the back patch but then it has two chest patches where on this vest, the uh, patches are more at my belly. I think part about this is it's extremely um, small when you pack it down. So when I'm done with it, I simply open up my Nelson rig pack back here. And because it packs down so small, it makes it really easy to take with me anywhere that I go. And then with that battery pack, it's small enough, it just slides into my pocket. Again, I can use that for my cell phone. I can use it for anything else, but on a motorcycle, Staying warm is important. Now you can layer up with non-heated gear and you're only gonna get so far down the road before that wind that's hitting the front of your jacket is gonna eventually permeate through to the center or core of your body. And that's where having heat as an element, heating up the internal air chamber of your jacket will keep you on the road for a lot longer. Now let me get this vest back out for its farewell to you in this video today. Again, super lightweight, nice and comfortable. You can wear it open, you can wear it closed. You can use heat, you don't have to use heat. It's really awesome as far as the features that this vest has for a $49.99 price point. Anyway, here in the pocket, you have your USB charge port. Again, you can use any charge bank that you have laying around the house, or you can purchase a brand new one. They're relatively inexpensive and they're gonna keep you nice, toasty, and warm throughout the day. Anyway. Quick little electric vest review for you here. I've been wearing this vest for about two months now. I use it every single morning when I leave for work, when it's 50 degrees or so. 
And then as soon as it gets warm, I take it off, toss it in the tail bag. That there is the Nelson Rig commuter tail bag if you're interested. I'll put a link down in the description for this guy as well. Super convenient, very helpful. I love it when I'm out there. Riding my motorcycle, don't want to wear a backpack, but I want to take a couple things with me. That thing does a great job. Anyway, electric vest available on Amazon can get to your house in like two business days, super quick. It's almost Christmas. It's almost the new year. Lots of crazy things are happening right now. And I got more on that later, so stay tuned. Thanks for watching guys. I really appreciate you. Without you guys, this channel wouldn't be anything. We're getting close to 10,000 subs. Super stoked about that. Gonna have a t-shirt coming out here pretty soon that I'm creating, exemplifying the mini bikes persona. I mean, we've ridden everything on this channel from sport bikes to cruisers to adventure bikes to I mean, spiders and side-by-sides, all kinds of stuff. So a huge thank you to all of you who are watching. I really appreciate it. And if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. We're like 250 people away. It's pretty excited for that 10,000 mark. Anyway, I'm Carl Bradshaw. Thank you guys for watching. Till next time, take care and ride safe out there.